Hi, and welcome to Best in Tesla, a little Tesla short, because we got a great new electric semi-truck coming out. And that's awesome, but it does give us a great showcase of just how much in front Tesla's semi-truck really is, because the bigger the vehicle, the more Tesla's efficiency shows. And we have this nice little company here in Swiss in a Swiss company in Switzerland uh, that is called Designwerk. They are making all kinds of electromobility, one-stop shopping. They have some battery technology and charging technology, but they are also making these semi-trucks. So they have these great big semi-trucks. Let me just click. Here is the one, the big bad boy. Uh, that is a direct competitor to Tesla's semi-truck, but it doesn't come with a lot of range compared to the Sigma truck. It's a nice truck. They have three different battery sizes to choose from. If we take the one with 900 kilowatt hours or 870 kilowatt hours to be exact, that is very close to what we expect to be in the Tesla Sigma truck. <clears throat> and this one has 640 kilometers of range, but that is without a trailer. So Tesla is going to have 800 kilometers of range with a trailer fully loaded. So this is without a trailer. So I do expect it to be about 500 kilometers loaded with a trailer. And Tesla will have 800 kilometers with a trailer fully loaded. So this truck is going to be much less efficient than the Tesla Sigma truck because they have kind of the same size battery as what we expect anyway. But you get about 60% more range with your Tesla semi-truck. That's a lot of bang for your buck. But <clears throat> it does get a little bit worse because it does actually um, also charge from 10 to 80%. So about 220 miles of range it will get in about three and a half hour. So in three and a half hours, this Design vac semi truck will get 220 miles of range, where Tesla semi truck will get 350 miles of range in 30 minutes. So it will get in 30 minutes more range than this truck can even do fully charged with a load and trailer, of course. But Tesla semi truck will get again here 60%, about 60% more range, seven times faster. 60% more range, seven times faster. That's just mind-blowing how much more efficient this is. But it gets even worse because this is a European company. So I will bet you that these estimates down here of range estimates is WLTP. They does, it doesn't say here, so maybe it's just their own range estimates, but... That's probably even worse. But this is the, probably WLTP, where the Tesla Sigma truck is, of course, um, EPA range, the, U, uh, the US version. So the real world range between these two Sigma trucks could be even more to Tesla's advantage. And it charged seven times faster. It's just kind of nuts <laughs> how good the Tesla semi truck is but also when you look at this design vac semi truck you can see they have not really re-engineered or redesigned how a semi truck looks it's still this wall pushing through the air they have not designed it like a bullet like Tesla has and they have not re-engineered the whole cabin and inside and how the how you work with the semi truck like Tesla has so this is just Good old version of a semi truck, but just with a huge battery and electric motors instead of a combustion engine. So that is great. Don't get me wrong. But if you are a, a trucking company that are looking for a Tesla or looking for a semi truck and you have the Tesla semi truck and you have this Designwerk semi truck or a Mercedes semi truck or anyone else that is in this kind of range, well, compared to a Tesla semi truck, uh, it doesn't really take any consideration to decide to do the Tesla Sigma truck instead of this truck or the Mercedes truck or the Volvo truck because they just can't keep up. The bigger the vehicle is, the more Tesla's efficiency shows. And this great electric truck 
great. Get it on the market. Awesome. And get it before Tesla comes. <laughs> because when you can buy either this one or the Tesla semi truck, it just becomes absolutely no brainer to get the semi truck, uh, Tesla semi truck, because it's just much better bang for your buck. These guys does come with a 1000 kilowatt hour battery pack, of course, but still without a trailer, only 700 kilometers. So it still has less range with a 1017 kilowatt hours of battery pack than what Tesla does because that's 800 kilometers with trailer and fully loaded. So yeah, there is just no competition to Tesla's semi truck just yet. There are a lot of other trucks out there, but this truck, if you want to buy this as a trucking company, it really has to be a lot cheaper than what Tesla is bringing to market. So we have to wait and see how affordable this semi truck is going to be, but I highly doubt it's going to be very affordable as it has either a 1000 kilowatt hours of battery pack or 900 kilowatt hours of battery pack or the small one with the smallest range that is not really fun but what did it have it had uh 750 kilowatt yes and that has three 530 kilometers of range but again without a trailer so yeah this semi truck <clears throat> really have to be affordable but with these huge batteries i highly doubt they're going to be very affordable and um yeah it's Nice that these electric trucks are coming out, but what a great showcase of just how far ahead Tesla is. There is a reason why Daimler or Mercedes <clears throat> went out and say that Tesla semi-trucks defy physics because they couldn't get a semi-truck to do what Tesla said they could. Neither could this, but Tesla has been out showing they can. So, um, yeah, in the semi-truck industry, there is really no competition for tesla just yet they are so far ahead it is ridiculous that's just all i wanted to talk about in this little tesla short so hope you enjoyed it if you did don't forget to hit that like button it really does help this video out a lot and uh, until next time take care out there and be nice